Here it is. Eligard's Redstone Laboratory. Seems more like an entrance or a foyer or something. Oh. Don't worry, pal. We'll find her. I just hope she can actually help us. Okay, so now there's got to be a way that we can get through this door. Now, I saw that there was a lever over here, and there's pressure plates right there. So let's go ahead and use it. All right, well, it's not... Okay. There we go. Holy fuck. Um, I'm not really sure what that does to help us, but there's another lever over here, so let's use this one. Alright, maybe now if we step on a pressure plate. We're through! Nice! First try. I don't even know exactly what I did there, but it worked. Wow, look at this place! She's got, like, resources getting sent up through tubes. That might be the most redstone stuff I've ever seen in my life. You can say that again. Come on, let's keep moving. Man, this place is cool. Uh-oh. What are those things even for? Maybe, I don't know, breaking things up, keeping intruders out. There are lots of possibilities. Well, what if I just take this repeater then? Uh, use it. Okay, almost. Definitely a step in the right direction. We just have to increase the timer on it. There we go. There! Yeah. Nicely done, Jesse. You're pretty good at this. Hey, what can I say? Me and the Redstone just speak to each other. Uh huh. She's moving a lot of different ingredients around here. Man. Look at all this, huh? Whatever she's working on, if it requires all of these ingredients, it must be something really, really big. Any idea what all this does? Well, it's clearly taking all of these materials and doing something with them, but I'm not sure what yet. But boy, am I gonna find out. Come on, let's keep moving. The real question is, where is she getting all the materials from? Ah. All right, well... Now we've got... There's like a place I can go over here. Oh no, I can't go over there. So I guess we just, um... I guess we just pull the lever? We'll just do that. Wow. That's awesome. Yeah, that is really cool. Look at this place. It's so cool. I could never build anything like this. Is this... Oh, this is an elevator. definitely an elevator so now we just have to figure out how to work it here um olivia let's uh, how can i there we go talk to olivia this close to meeting eligard getting excited like you wouldn't believe i wonder what she'll really be like in person hopefully she's not mean or evil all right well let's push the button first and we'll see what that does are those? Bats? Yeah. I wonder why she even has that circuit. Uh-oh. It's probably a warning thing. Alright, I guess we'll just pull the lever. There we go. So now, we use the zipper. Oh my god! Yeah, it's an elevator! That's so cool! I've built some of those elevators before. Oh, there she is. Look at all of this stuff. She hasn't even noticed us. This is just like I dreamt it. Entering Eligard's laboratory, seeing her right there. She'll ask me to be her apprentice, and the next thing you know, we'll be changing the world together. Let's just try to save the world first. Time to pace back and forth and check the systems. Inventory request, operational. Delivery latency, speedy. Still talking to myself? Yep. 
What if I push this button? Uh -huh. Okay. All well, right. Here we go. Yeah, I'm gonna push this button. Let's rock this block with another. Whoa! Hi. Hey. Didn't see you sneaking up on me. <laughs> Just that's the point. Don't touch anything in here, okay? It's all supremely fragile and genius. Okay. Did Calvin send you? You my new assistants? New assistants with a stupidly <laughs> adorable pig, that is. <laughs> Jessie, she thinks we're her new assistants. This is so exciting. Eligard. No time for specifics, I'm afraid. Hey, you. Goggle girl. Switch on that T-flop circuit to activate the delivery chutes. And you, non-goggle guy, grab me a blaze rod and an iron block. She wants me to do something for her. What if I screw it up? What if I... Oh, I feel lightheaded. Don't pass out. I need you here. Oh, my God. Wow. Now I need an assistant to help with my assistant. Think you can handle it on your own? I guess. Uh, Olivia? You okay? Olivia? O Olivia, can you hear me? I don't think that I've ever fainted before. Ugh, so embarrassing. Everything working over... Ooh. Hmm. Fine, I I'll just do it myself then. I was gonna do it. Holy shit. Come on, come on, come on. Big winner, big winner, big. Loser. Ugh. Trial number 6,451. Another bust. Wow. Now, about you three. Uh, your friend here. Does she fall over frequently? Is this gonna be a regular occurrence? I... no. I'm sorry. I was just so excited to... And with me always pacing around, lost in my own brilliant thoughts, I could have tripped over you and conked my brain. Brilliant thoughts, gone. <laughs> I could see that. Eligard, we've actually got much bigger problems to deal with. We're actually here to get your help. There's a giant wither storm and it's attacking the entire world. A wither what? What are you talking about? Who, who sent you? Was it Calvin? That'd be Gabriel. Calvin? Gabriel sent me. Look, you both seem like very pleasant people who are prone to fainting, but I simply don't have the brain power for this. I'm in the middle of my greatest project to date. A powerful block capable of altering reality itself. I'm so close I can practically taste it. And it tastes like victory with a side of sweet, sweet redstone engineering. I've seen one of those before. It's a command block. Wait, 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 wait. How do you know what a command block is? Not to seem belittling, but we are talking about some mega, ultra genius level stuff here. You've seen one up close before. It was Ivor's. He's done something terrible with it. The world needs the Order of the Stone. That's why we're here. Ugh, sorry to bust your circuits, but the Order isn't really together anymore. We, uh, sort of disassembled. That's actually kind of why we're here. Gabriel's amulet. This certainly changes things. Haven't seen one of these in a long time. Yes, he gave it to me to find the order. It's how we found you. Yes, this is serious indeed. All the more reason why I need to finish my command block. I can use it to fight this witherstorm monster thing or whatever. Necessity is the originator of invention. And that monster is my necessity for inventing, of which I am the originator. Is that even possible? Can you really do that? This is the Eligard you're talking to. Who is me, if you're confused. And I, Eligard, will make a command block today. Your Witherstorm problem was created by a command block, yes? That means a command block could be the perfect way of beating it. And maybe Will you help me make one. Oh. It's going to work this time. I can feel it. Oh no. Right here, in my brain. I could help too. Fuck, what do we have to do here? I don't know. Do we stay and work with her on her command block or do we leave? I mean, we've come all this way. We pretty much have to finish out this part of the journey, am I right? I think I think so. So we'll we'll build the command block. You're the genius, Eligard. Let's get started. Fantastic. She is kind of a little bit of a know-it-all though. So 
now we've got some resources in the block or in the chest. Now we just gotta flip some switches and I actually, I actually don't know how to build a command block. That's one thing I don't know. Okay. What do we do with this stuff now? It looks like you were just trying to take four crafting tables and mush stuff together. All right, well, at least I don't have to put anything in any particular order. Oh no, Olivia. Come on, Olivia, you can do this. Oh, Ruben's even helping. Nice. Come on, it's gotta work. Damn it. Well, we need another we need another trial. The combination's gotta be there somewhere. Just exactly what's the right one, I don't know. I hope this is the right decision though. It makes sense that if we had a command block, we'd be able to do what we needed to do to beat the Wither Storm. Damn it. Talk about a build sequence. Third time's the charm, right? Get it. Okay, okay, excellent. Good. This is so exciting. Terribly exciting. Has it gotten this far before? No, never! Is it destabilizing? Oh! oh no. The Wither Storm! She wasn't even gonna run. We actually had to rescue her. Oh my god, how did it get here so quickly? We need to go. We need to get to the portal. I'm so sorry. So, so sorry. Now this place is gonna be gone too. <gasps> Ruben! Thank God you made it, Ruben. It's it gotten even bigger! Every, everyone's inventions are gone! The portal! Hurry! Oh no! Oh my god! Jesse! Yeah, hitting it with a stone sword. I don't know if that's gonna be the best thing, but it's the only thing we got. Over here! This way! Jesse! Oh, grab it! No! Somebody help, please! I'm dangling on the edge of stairs! Wait, now we're back at the temple. I mean, at least we got her back here. Are Axel and Lucas still here? Okay, just a little farther. Well, that's certainly impressive. Wow. It looks like they got some of the light lighting situation sorted out. Yeah. Creeper! Oh, who goes there? Oh, Jesse? Is that you? Yes, sir. Uh, we're back. Lucas, hey, we're back. I'm so oh. glad you're back. He just popped right in. And we brought Eligard. Fantastic. Quick, come on. You guys are never going to believe who showed up while you were gone. Petra, yes. Petra. Hey, guys, how's it going? Yes. I'm so happy she made it. I'm so glad you're okay, Petra. Yeah, I'm pretty stoked about it myself. And it's really good to see you, Jesse. Back there in Gabriel's bunker, it got pretty dicey. 
It's such a relief to see you. I'm glad you're okay. You pulled me out of that Witherstorm's crutches, and I ran and ran and ran for the temple. If you hadn't saved me, well, I owe you everything, Jesse. I'm just glad I heard Gabriel telling you where to go. I'm so glad to see you. Did anyone else get away? Were there any other survivors? It's all a blur, but the weather storm left almost nothing behind. Everything, everyone, was just gone. It even got Gabriel. Oh, no. I wouldn't believe that anything could defeat Gabriel if I hadn't seen it for myself. This is terrible. Damn it. Boy, can't remember the last time I saw this place. Would someone care to explain what he is doing here? They got Magnus. We call this a hunch, but do you two not like each other? Right. I forgot to mention. Axel went on a little... adventure of his own while you were gone. An adventure to get him? Did you know about this? Why didn't you tell me? You did this on purpose. Hey, Axel's my friend, okay? I didn't know he was going to get Magnus. You gotta believe me. Well, I hope you're not expecting me to work with that cretin. Look, just wait here a second while I figure out what's going on. Much appreciated. We tried to help you build your command block. The least you can do is wait. So, who are you then? And why'd you bring the Queen of the Nerds with you? That's Jesse, my best friend. Trust me, Jesse's totally cool. I'll, uh, <laughs> I'll be the judge of that, huh? Hey, Eligard is cool, and she's going to help stop this wither storm. Ellie? <laughs> cool? <laughs> oh, uh, oh, wait, 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 you're serious? Oh, wow, that's, uh, that's, uh, woo, ha, oh, boy. I got tired of waiting around, so I decided to go recruit Magnus myself. It was kind of a crazy adventure, but it all worked out in the end. Now, I'm the king of Boomtown. Ah! We've been bonding and stuff. I've had, like, the best day. Did you say... Yeah, I did. I had to beat him in a crazy tournament, and... Long story, you had to be there. Short version, epic battle of explosions and mayhem, death-defying action, shenanigans, and pyrotechnic. Bada-bing, bada-boom! Your friend here is kind of supreme ruler of my kingdom now, you know what I mean? Really? Well, this is unexpected. I'm not entirely sure what you mean, but I'm definitely sure that I don't like it. Yeah, show him some respect. Oh, you're sticking up for Magnus, that's very sweet. Yeah, he's sticking up for me. It's because I'm really awesome and super cool. I'll never understand your fans. Would you all cut it out? Holy crap, you're all acting like crazy people. Uh, people, can we please focus on the bigger picture? We have a very hungry Witherstorm in the process of turning the whole world into its dinner. It was terrifying. It came out of nowhere and just destroyed everything. A little too scary for you, Ellie? Couldn't just think it away? You weren't there, Magnus, I'm telling you. This thing was like nothing I've ever seen. Why? Because it's never come inside one of your little workshops? Would you two stop fighting? Whoa! Yikes. Jesse's right. We need to find some way to stop that thing. Well, I don't know if you've had the chance to poke around this old dump yet, but it's pretty much stripped bare. It would take a mountain of TNT to kill that thing. I hate to say it, but you have a point. This is amazing. I know. Are they getting along? Can we start crafting some then? I don't think we got that kind of time. But against such an unthinkable enemy, even all the TNT in the world might not be enough. If only Soren were here, he might have something we could use. Oh, Ellie, not this again. You know I hate when you brag about you and Soren's little brainy club. I'm not bragging. I think I've got a legitimate idea here. What are you talking about? What did Soren have? Soren had a kind of super TNT. Stronger and more explosive than anything else in the world. The Formidabomb. 
Ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard all about the F-bomb before. <laughs> F-bomb? Yeah. Soren claimed that dropping the F-bomb could destroy anything. But I've never it's seen it It's real. Before. I swear. Uh-huh. Well, the Formidabomb sounds perfect. We should go get it now. Well, there's a little problem there. We don't know where Soren is. But you found us. Do you know where he is? He wasn't on the map. So, no. But I mean, we have to try again. Our map could locate him. Unless he's in the nether, or the end. But it's worth a shot. He wasn't on the map. I think we can find him. Um, yeah, he wasn't on the map. He wasn't on the map. Oh, man, now we get to talk to everybody else again. I can't believe these two heroes, and I'm putting that in air quotes, they bicker so much about things from the past. My God. All right, let's talk to Petra. How are you, Petra? Fine. You okay? We can talk about it later. Let's just do this map for now. Wow. She's really changed since the whole event. Hello, Eligard. You said you know how to activate the map? I'm very curious to see it. I've never actually seen it work before. Let's talk to Axel. Hey, Axel, how are you doing? I'm hanging out with Magnus. I'm doing awesome. Glad to hear it, buddy. I was gonna say, glad to hear it. Right, um, I don't think we can talk to Magnus, so let's talk to Lucas. How are you holding up, Lucas? I'm all right. This has all been pretty intense. I feel like if I think too much about what's been going on, well, I'll just think I'm completely nuts. How does Petra seem to you? Not great, I guess. But she has been through a lot. Yeah. But you saved her. You did an amazing thing, Jesse. That is, that is true. We did save her. All right, well, I don't know where Olivia went. Oh, here's Olivia right here. Hey, Olivia, you okay? I'm all right. I can't shake the feeling that I embarrassed myself back in Redstonia, in front of Eligard. I think she kind of judges me a little bit. It'll be okay. I hope you're right. To be perfectly honest, they're both kind of jerks, Magnus and, uh, and Eligard. Like, I'm just gonna use the pedestal. I don't want to talk to anybody else anymore. Let's get down to business. All right, so now we got to flip all the levers again. And I don't remember the order from when I did it the first time, so this should actually be pretty interesting. Um, use the switch. Oh, is it just going to make me pull one? Oh, that was easy. All right, there's your light, my light. That's new. There he is. Soren had his fortress deep inside the mountains. After the order broke up, that's where he went to keep doing his experiments. Look, he invited me there a couple times, but it always seemed a little weird, right? It always seemed a little weird. Glad we can agree on that at any rate. I mean, I never actually went there with him. That's probably the only time you made the right call. So why aren't we going? Is there some kind of problem? Whoa. It didn't do that before. Are you sure it's working? Blue? Blue? That's Ivor! Ivor is going to Soren's. We need to move! It's not too far. We could probably make it on foot. Righteous! We'll get some rest and head out first thing in the morning. Avoiding all the nighttime monsters everything. If you had seen that monster, you wouldn't be saying that. We need to leave. Now! I think it's following us, Magnus, and I don't want to risk it catching up with us. We have to go. Now. It's so bad that you're gonna just go waltzing out in the woods at night. It's not night yet. We'll just go as fast as we can. Yeah, I don't want the Witherstorm catching up with us. We should go now. An excellent call, Jesse. 
and far more decisive than either of us are being. What a coincidence that it's your plan. But fine. We need to go now. The thing already caught up to Redstonia. And I can't believe Blue is Ivor. I would have thought Blue would have been Gabriel. But yeah, he's already got a head start, so we need to leave as soon as possible.